Mm. What's up, everybody? Hi, chat. How's it going, everybody? Welcome back. Oof. We're in the middle of the road. That's, uh, <laughs> that's not good. All right. Welcome back, everybody, to uh, Tourist Bus Simulator. Should be a good time here today as we get started with uh, going down the road. Apparently, this island's real. I had no idea. We're, like, in the Canary Islands and, like, office somewhere. I don't know. It's owned by Spain. I have no idea. Anyway, we're going to learn more, and we're going to do some bussing. Yeah, it should be a good time. CM Smith, thanks very much for subscribing. Thanks very much, everybody, for clicking and tapping that uh, subscribe button and everything. How do I... What is this, mirror? What? Oh, I hit some weird... Oh, I hit a weird button. I don't know what I hit. Let's go back into the bus. There we go. All right, that's what I wanted. Why are all of our... Wow, the game starts with your engine off and everything? <laughs> We're literally spawned just in the midst of traffic. Okay. All right, well, let's get in our seat. And let's uh, begin. All right, we should be in. Although I can't look around, why is that? That's kind of weird. I can't actually like look down at the. Uh... Okay, that's weird. Oh, there we go. Now I can. Can I look around again? All right. Well, for whatever reason, I can't look around. All right. Well, let's get the engine started. So start engine with E. I'm pressing E. This is a weird thing that happens in this game where you have to like switch it back and. It, the game starts it in neutral, and then you have to, like, put it in not neutral for whatever reason. You gotta, like, put it into first gear, then back into neutral. Alright, and then... Oh, headlights are on. Wow, are you serious? Super important, uh... Super important air conditioning had to be turned on before we moved. Alright, we're better. Although I just can't seem to turn my... Oh, there we go. Whoa, what, 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 what? Can you steer with the middle mouse button? What? I didn't know you could do that. That's weird. I'm trying to, like, get the uh, bus to look around, but it won't won't look around. I don't know. Seems legit. All right. Well, welcome back, everybody. If you want to see more of this game, you know what to do. It seems really loud. Is it really loud? It seems really loud. Let me adjust the sounds here. All right, let's see. Uh, master volume, I guess we'll turn that down a little bit. Seems really loud. Oh. And what is going... Are you kidding me? This game's got a real problem with, like, that mouse for whatever reason. It's really strange. I can't seem to, uh, like, get the mouse to look around anymore. Maybe there was an update and they changed all the controls. I don't know. Anyway, apparently you can also drive with the middle mouse button. I've never seen that before. Thanks, Roberto. Well, good to have you here. Thank you very much for uh, dropping by. Again, if you like this, make sure you go ahead and click or tap that subscribe button, too, in order to uh, see more of this wonderful content. All right, so we're going to pick up some passengers. I think we this is uh, picking up from our last stream where like, I stopped in the middle of the road. I think we have to go pick up some passengers and then bring them somewhere. I'm not sure exactly where we're going, but... Anyway, hopefully I can uh, feel the controls again. This is a lot different than ATS. It's really, really strange. But it's really cool. A lot of dangerous roads here. You're watching with your dog? Welcome, man. Hey, welcome, everybody. Good to see you all here. Welcome back, chat. Thanks again, everybody, for your super chats this week. And welcome to uh, Troy. Uh, now Lynn, who has uh, clicked or tapped that join button, becoming a member here today. Sometime... Uh, over the week, so thank you very much, Troy. Welcome. Oof, I'm gonna have to get used to all this driving again. This game's a little weird, too, because it'll lag for a split second every once in a while, which w really throws me off. They've got to work on optimizing that. That's, like, my biggest complaint as of now. Because it kind of throws you off when you're in the midst of motion. Alright, here's Antigua again. Do-do-do-do-do. I just need to be able to look around with the mouse. That's the only other thing. YouTuber, you should run somebody over. Go fast. Blow the horn. YouTuber, YouTuber. YouTuber, I gotta go. <laughs> I love that. Well, no, there are some serious problems with the game, including the bus as well. It's not just, uh... My bad-o driving. 
like I mentioned, you can control with the middle mouse button, but it used to be the control in order to look around the bus. So they've kind of just changed everything all of a sudden. So there must have been an update or something like that. YouTuber, you'll cater to my immediate need. I'll need you to drive off the cliff. It'll have to explode, and then I gotta go. My Wendy's is almost here. Mother! I would like to only the premium cut. I'll have Dave's triple, but I would like a patty saved for my later consumption. Good evening, Mother. Wow, look at these winding mountains, dude. This is going to be a dangerous haul. I'm funny? Yeah, I, I like to pick on the, the younger audience. Alright. I'll blow the horn if somebody clicks or taps that's, uh, that join button, or if we get any new subscribers today. How about that? Yeah, we're just chilling. All right. <clears throat> okay, well, the bus seems more responsive than it was, so they've definitely worked on that. So that's nice. And I hope the car is a lot better, too. The acceleration on the car is atrocious when you get started. If you've ever seen me drive that car before, it is bad. That car is like... Uh, okay. I guess you come to a complete stop if you rub into a uh, guardrail. All right. <laughs> You know, actually, I wonder... I don't think there's a damage model or anything on this game for anything, so you can't actually tell... So, apparent. Oh, actually, since nothing popped up, it literally... Nothing happened. We just came to a stop, that's all. Okay. There's nobody else in the bus other than me, so... All right, is it becoming date... Oh, yeah, that's right. It's early morning, so we gotta get down there. All right, I'm gonna try to... All right, starting now, I'm gonna try to stay super focused on the road now. This is a lot more challenging than uh, ATS or Euro Truck because these roads are a lot smaller and your vehicle is a lot bigger than the road. It is a tough time. All right, oof. Wow, these roads are super challenging. I love it. Take a little bit more time and get a little better at what we're doing. This is almost like, uh, you know what I need? I need somebody sitting behind me like in the rally races where they tell the driver what kind of turn is coming up and stuff. Like, seriously, some of these roads are just as challenging. This is like dr playing a drift driving game, like where you're, you're doing some off-road challenge, and, uh, like, you're, you're literally doing it in a bus. So that is, uh, that is interesting. kidding me, dude? Alright, well, I guess if you get anywhere close to that thing, it just grabs you and pulls you right in. When you're driving a bump, it uh, simulates physics well. Yeah, it, it does a really good job with the bump physics and such. Actually, I think this is the tightest road we've been on so far. That actually was, uh, we were doing 90 through that road. This is... That's worse than the city roads. Those are usually tight, too. All right, we'll see how this works out. Got a little bit of lag before the turn. Man, they got to work on that. Yeah, welcome to all you guys who are new. If you're new here... Make sure you click or tap that subscribe button. Don't forget, you're going to miss out. 
Yeah, this is a man bus. Robert, thanks for seven. Yeah, we're in the Canary Islands. I don't know which one specifically. I guess the big one. Oh, wait, we're in Future, Vin Future Ventura. Is that what it's called? Something like that. Man, that lag, dude, every once in a while. I wish that just didn't happen. It makes it really difficult to drive. It makes you second guess your braking and everything. All right, I'm driving real recklessly. Starting now, I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, Right, right, right now. Okay, right now. Gashton, thanks for subscribing. All right, right now I'm going to try to really be cautious. I forgot how cautious we need to be in the game. JSP, thanks for seven. into a new town now. Oh yeah. Payara. Should be daytime soon. The sun is coming up, so it'll only get brighter, which makes things a lot easier. What's up, Project Zorgo? Don't forget the chips, yeah. Uh, the dips in this road are definitely going to go along well with those chips. This game is actually kind of challenging. It's It's got a little bit of a... It needs a little fix in the design a little bit, but I love the roadway and like the layout in general. But once you kind of learn how to work with the game's quirks and then uh, figure out the map a little bit, it makes it a little easier. Oh, the uh, Canary Islands were a huge tourist attraction in Sweden? Why? It's so, like, out of, out of nowhere. Thank you very much, Eggman, for the milk. I thought the Swedes like to go to Rhodes. The Greek island. Maybe maybe that's for budget Swedes. Yeah, look at that. We're getting like some... Oh, the frame rate just plummets. And then there's a little bit of lag. Oof. Yeah, I think this this game takes place in modern times because you actually have like a laptop and a smartphone and stuff, so it, it's definitely like today. I don't know actually how far it is to get to where we're going, but at least this this game is a, a much more uh, scenic drive than any others. The fact that they've uh, done one island and detailed it really makes it nice. It'd be cool if they did that in the American Truck Simulator. Pick like uh, one one state and super, super detail it, but oh well. Alright, let's see if we can get over. I can't look up. I don't know why I can't look up. I can zoom in, which is useless. Oh, wait, can I actually raise the... I, don't, I can't get the driver to actually look up so I can see more of the rear view mirror, side view mirror. Farming Sim helped you with your depression? Well, I know there's a lot of people who say that too, so if anybody's going through a bad time, thanks for watching. And I hope things get better for you. Oof, is this Texas? Uh, no, this, this island is like volcanic and crazy. Oh, look at all that beautiful... I, I love this road because it's like all dusty. It's like it's like we built a road on Mars. This, 
should just be called like Mars Colony Driver. Oh, well, gotta get to work down at the old uranium mines. Gotta go pick everybody up. God, that frame rate and that lagging is just irritating. It's one thing they've got to work on. I could also lower my settings too, but my PC is so beastly that there's no there's no excuse for it. It's it's game design wise. You think I drove right into another game? Yeah, now we're in ATS because there's a, actually a straight highway. It'd be interesting being an actual driver on this island. Like, it, it would take you like an hour to get from one end of the island to the other. I've got it floored right now. How fast are we going? I can't even look down, so... I don't know, there's some sort of problem with that. I don't know. Yeah, it's almost like Hawaii too, yeah. Hawaii's got a lot of roads like this as well. But they're more highways and such. Eric Mann, thanks for seven. I wonder if I brought the graphics down from like ultra or ultra high to just like, if I brought it down if it would improve the frame rate a little bit, because that is just getting annoying. I mean, it's like this. You know, like, that's kind of annoying. Oop. Supposed to stop here, huh? Alright, let's open the doors. I guess I stopped over the line a little bit. There's not even people here. Am I seriously stopping here? Uh, current route. Oh, wow, look at all the stops on that one. I'm going to back up a little bit. There we go. Is anybody getting on? This was indicated as a stop. Maybe I'm late. I don't, I don't know. Also, I'm picking this up from another game, so I don't know if the time's changed or something. will be good. There we go. Well, hopefully that worked out. I don't know. We'll see. Why do they have an H for a bus stop too, by the way? Is that is that Spanish for bus? Is, why the H? At first I thought it meant hotel. But that doesn't have anything to do with it. thing though this bus has excellent acceleration oh that's right there's also the uh, gas station too I've never had to stop for gas yet Wait, it says our first stop is Moro, Moro Jabe. Why did it tell me to stop back there then? Oh, this game. It's like Men of War. There's a lot of problems with it, and I just can't stop playing it. That was a turn. All right. Just got to follow this road for a little while. Hotel Sh Sade. Santa Fit. In 
into what? A chimney? Your dad's a bus driver? Dude, sweet. I hope he drives like a cool, complicated route like, like this. This is really awesome. Let's see if I can get the mouse out of here for now. Also, we gotta take a left, so. Ah, here's where we stop first. Okay. Hmm. It's just weird that they have the blue indicators on like this where you're supposed to stop, but if it's not your your stop, then it shouldn't be on the list. All right, let's put her in uh, neutral. Put the brake on. All right, come on board, everybody. Uh, what's the button to look? There we go. All the navigation to the next destination. No one here? All right. Hmm. Hope we still get money for this contract. I hope me, like, stopping in the midst of a contract and coming back didn't glitch anything out. I don't know at this point. We'll see. also doesn't seem to like require you to be there by any sort of time you know what I mean so it's not like you have to stop at uh, X bus stop by like a certain time at least I haven't seen any specific date or time like it says it says dates but it doesn't say time there we go oh we're just rolling now sweet Stay in the right. Nice. Happy Monday, everybody. By the way, good start of the week. How's everybody's Monday going? Anybody have dinner yet? What'd you have? I'm getting hungry. I think I'm going to have spaghetti tonight. I think. Oh, here we are. Our first passengers. There we go. All right. Hop on board, gang. There we go. Takes a little while for everybody to like climb on the bus. As if like they were but they were like, oh a bus. What's up, Liddy? How's it going, ma'am? Shelliff? Shelliff, thanks for seven. That's what complicated name. Alright, back onto the highway we go. The highway is pretty rough and bumpy, but the road before it is even worse. I'm on our way here. Well, it's nice to see the lights out. How do I become a member? Click or tap the join button down below. You should see it highlighted in blue or green. I don't see the join button. Go ahead and hop on your PC then. It should be there. Sometimes it's not available on consoles or something like that. If you don't see it, it's just not available in your country. And my God, do you guys see the road we're about to go down? Oh, this is death. Oh, this is death. This is death. And now the GPS has disappeared. It did tell me we had to go down this way. Now, now it reappeared again. Oh, this is death. This is death. This is death. This is death. We're all dead. F's in chat, guys. Rip. It's all over. Oh, this is death. Oh, this is death. Oh, this is death. Ooh, 
Oof. Oof. Yeah, ma'am. Thank you for stopping, because this is, this is death. Wow, a two-way? Oh, my God. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, my God. <laughs> wow. Everybody knows. Are you kidding me? This is insanity right now. This is unexpected. Oof. Well, we're going to hit stuff because this is just like oof. Hey, uh, you want to be a bus driver? Sure. All right. Go down Death Mountain for your first job. What the f... How are you even supposed to do this as a human being? You have to be a cyborg. This is incredible. Wow, I can't wait to learn how to master this. That's awesome. <laughs> wow. This is cool. Oh, I can't wait to uh, try this one again. Look at that frame rate. God, the game with the frame rate. Did you see that? And then it didn't register my full turn. I probably wouldn't have made it anyway, but... At least we wouldn't have gone into the rocks. Damn, that irritates me. Now we're not even going? Oh, there. I really don't even know how to approach this, you know? There we go. I guess going slower is also a good thing. Oh, I forgot we had passengers, too. Well, that's uh, GG on that. Is there an engine brake on the bus? Yeah, it's broken right now. Yeah, all right, I guess we can take a right and go back. Uh, I guess we'll just come back around this way. That's fine. We'll just take a right at that intersection. Wow. Yeah, that uh, that was an awesome, challenging road, though. I'd see with more practice, I'll be able to do stuff like that with ease, and then you know I'll get better. The only way it's going to happen is with practice, because there's no tutorial. Uh, Jeff, thanks for subbing. Yeah, I know I missed a stop. We have to be on the other side of the road, though, so that's why we're we're going this way so we can get on the other side. Thanks for seven. There we go. I guess we're going back up the hill now. Oh, God. All right, well, I think going up is probably going to be a little easier than going down. We'll see. Ma'am? Sir? Oh, this is going to be... Oof, with a side of... Uh. Let's see what happens. Oh, man. Swing wide early on wide turns. Uh, there's not a lot of road, and there's a lot of oncoming traffic, so, uh, you know, there's that. Okay. All right, I'm going to stay focused. Let's see if we can do this. Nope. No way. No way, dude. Wow, that is the ultimate challenge. There needs to be a challenge mode in this game. And also, if I swing wide, you know what's going to happen, right? The moment I do that, oncoming traffic is going to come straight down. I gotta drive an RV in real life. So, like, here's the problem with this is if I need to complete the turn, I gotta go, like, into the opposite lane of traffic. We just gotta hope that nobody comes down. This is awesome, though. Oh, there goes the frames again. It doesn't register the turn when that happens. Come on, baby. There we go. Yeah, we're playing Rip Bus right now. Dude, this is cool, though. I like it. Whew. 
Apparently these are real roads and such too. This is how it really is. According to people who said they looked at the map, it's this is a real place that has real roads like this. Well, at least I made it with uh, a little less trouble going up than uh, when we went down. Okay, not bad. Very cool. All right, back onto the highway. Oh, man. I want like a thousand dollar hazard pay bonus on this one. Imagine being the crew that originally had to make that road going down there. They probably needed a bulldozer, they probably needed pavers and people with pickaxes and such. This road should not be an ATS. Yeah, there's no way, there's no way. Like, you would have to take up, first of all, this is the size, both lanes here is the size of one lane in like ATS. Like, you need all the space you can get. It's cool when you're out on these open roads, but I get, those roads make me nervous, those hill roads. That was cool, though. That was nice. I want to do it again. Let's do it again. We need another reason to go down there. Speed limit says to do 60, so we do 50 and still bottom out. Okay. All right. You know, I don't think it does anything to the bus, though, if that happens. I think it's just telling you to slow down. The most damage only comes when you, when you ram into things head-on or if you uh, just drive the bus enough, like you have to have repairs for, uh, like, your um, oil change, tire change, that kind of thing. Did that sound like a lot of damage? That's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage. No, I don't think so, not at all. Alright. Well, we've had a lot of fun so far. I almost died several times. That, that's great. I gotta get used to remembering that we're not we're not driving like ATS and stuff. I'm so used to it that I just I wanna go fast and think that the road's like open and clear, but you really got... This game is mostly about sl slowing around down. Yeah, we're getting no bonus on this one. Plus, I guess these roads are bad enough, so it's a good idea to just slow her on down. Oh, could you imagine driving this bus if, a ma if it was a manual? Oh my god. Alright, unlock doors. Goodbye. Ooh, it's weird to me how we have to circle around at the other bus stop. Like, as a pedestrian, couldn't you just, like, walk across the street and get on? Passengers thinking? I have no idea. This game is a great challenge, though. It, it The difficulty ramps up pretty quick, but it's already difficult enough with the game's glitches and also the roads in general. Like, seriously, if this is if this was the perfect game, the roads would still be interesting. Which makes me want to see, like, a Japan variant where the roads are really congested and, uh, not congested, but they're just very, uh, very small. And driving a big vehicle down that would not be easy. Alright, I think we took that car out nice. That was worth bonus points. Seriously, sometimes I don't know how to approach. Like, you get such a narrow turn, and there's uh, 
curves and such. It's hard to tell where to go. But we are exploring more of the map. There we go. And it's all about the speed and such. You used to drive a 36 foot RV? My god. Yeah, this is certainly not the same as, uh, it's like driving the trailer. Well, it's been a few days since I played. I, I gotta play this a few days in a row, because I would get used to it and finally actually how to do, learn how to do things. Okay, let's, uh, turn off this and unlock doors one and two. There we go. What's up, James? How's it going? Hi everyone in chat, welcome. Welcome, welcome. Thanks again guys for your super chats today. Thanks for clicking and tapping that join button and thanks as always for uh, subscribing if you're new here. We're almost to 400,000 by the end of the month we will be there. So thank you as always for your support. Look at that, somebody left their uh, toolbox at the bus stop. A lot of people are like leaving some real valuable stuff behind. You don't want to do that. Once you get used to how to make the right hand turn, I'll fly through it, hopefully. It's not just that though, I don't know, sometimes it's like just turning in general in a tight space, that kind of thing. So we'll see. We'll see, but I have gotten better from when I started. I kind of learned how to deal with the game's awkwardness. It has kind of a rough start, but it's still, still pretty good. I mean, the fact that I'm back to play this game for like a third time means that it is pretty enjoyable. Yes, that's right, Dane. <laughs> I guess part of it is just managing speed, being very precise with the speed. Yeah, that's much better. All right, let's get on that highway. A few things now. <laughs> hello from Greece. Well, hello back to you. I also heard another crash. Did I, did I cut somebody off back there? I didn't. I truly didn't see any car in the rear view when I looked. Maybe it's the bus bottoming out again. I hope not. Oh, don't tell me we have to go back to Death Road again. Looks like they're building a new road there. Hopefully it's better than this one. More flat at least. And this country needs to invest in bulldozers. We just need to flatten the whole country out. Build a Walmart parking lot here. That's all we gotta do. You can do 110 on the highway. No way. From South Africa, Brandon. Well, thanks for watching, man. Must be kind of late over there, isn't it? Got to be at least like, uh, ooh, it's got to be past midnight, isn't it? South Africa. Yeah, I'm using the steering wheel. You can check out the equipment I use down below in the description. Oh, drop frames all the time. I think we gotta go down death road again. Alright, let's see if we can do this a little better this time. Third time should be a charm. We'll see. Now 
try to adjust the graphics or something, see what we can do. Ooh, there, oh, there's motion blur? No, thank you. Oh, yeah, everything's set to, like, epic. St set stuff to high. See if that helps the game a bit. Oh, it's either high or medium. I will set it to medium then. Set everything to medium and see how it works. Maybe that'll help a little bit. Hi, Chris Pinto. How's it going? Nope, still dropping frames. I think it's just the game in general. Alright, here we go. Watch this, Pinto. I'm gonna be like that one Japanese bus driver that we saw in that video that one time. Alright, here we go. Chat, get the get those F's ready, chat. You know, when Pinto visited me in real life, all he ever did was criticize my driving, to be honest. I like how the AI guy kind of gets to stay on like a slot car racetrack. Like there's no, there's no way that car could take a turn that sharp at that speed. Ooh, oh, I don't think we're gonna. Oh, we made it! Oh my god. All right, a few more practice, and we should be able to do it smoothly. Goes the big frames again. It really throws out my braking when I do that. Because it, uh, what it does is it takes away your reaction time. Like the game won't count any sort of inputs for speed adjustment, so thus you kind of are screwed. Okay, we bumped something there. I don't know what that was, but we we did it. Everybody's not dead. Yay! All right. Take that Pinto. Got him. Wow, this game's little little lags and frame drops are just everywhere, and I don't know why. Okay. Seem like anybody's getting off. All right, not bad. We went down the hill with minimal problems. That was good. Oh, I scraped the floor a little bit. Okay. Well, that wasn't too bad compared to what could have happened. I'm going to go this way. We'll end up on the same road. So it doesn't seem more about, this game isn't as much about timing as it is about, like, don't die. Don't, don't, like, jostle the passengers. I also can't control my mouse to look around. I wonder if there's... Can I use these keys to... Uh oh, that's not good. How do I look around when I'm in the... I don't know what the manual keys are. Alright, I'm gonna head up hill now. New subscriber 
This doesn't seem as hard because you can adjust your speed a little bit better. Kava, thanks for subbing. All right, here we go up Death Mountain. Dear God, welcome to all the new subscribers too. If you haven't already, click or tap that subscribe button. God, the frames, the frames, dude. And now I'm going into the wall because of that. Is it seriously? If I set it to the lowest settings, it is actually becoming a problem. Is it this part of the game or what? I'm just gonna let put everything on just potato. I don't know what that is. It's really starting to get irritating to me because it, I'm just not able to control the bus with the game not taking into account my uh, controls. Okay, let's try again. Why, this is the game on its lowest settings now. It's probably still going to drop frames, though. I can, I can tell. No, I turned everything, like, off or down. Oh, dear God. Well, ma'am, you should have seen my bus coming. Right away, ma'am. Right away. And there's still frames being dropped, too. Okay, well, at least we went down with, like, precision. But going up is a little tougher, it seems. I don't know why the mouse doesn't uh, before you could like you could click and then look around with the mouse but it doesn't seem to work you can zoom in but that's it it's really strange Kermit thanks for seven do I prefer this or bus sim 18 dude they're they're both games that involve buses but they're completely different games right, let's see if we can get less frames to be dropped it's really annoying I guess the the real test now will be on the highway. Damn, that roundabout's always tight. Is there a is there like an oh there it goes yep dropping frames still. I wonder if there's an in-game thing where you can see uh, FPS frames per second. Like, I need to get 60 frames per second in order to drive realistically here. This part also had a lot of drop frames, but it was a little less back there. Okay, well, I guess a little optimization of the game will help things. Since it doesn't seem to do much, though, I guess we may as well turn it back up and just deal with it. You're just, you're just, you're, you're just bad at the game, YouTuber. You're, you're just bad. Yeah, that's right. Bad to the bone, baby. I'm, a, I'm bad to the bone bus driver. Okay. Well, there's the graphics all the way up. Oh, does it actually... Wait a minute. If I drive in the middle... Oh, no. It doesn't get rough or anything. Okay. Cool. Thanks, Harry. Actually, it does seem like the frame rate tanks when you come in here. Well, hopefully the developers uh, take note of that and make an adjustment to it. It's been a couple weeks, though, so it must be a smaller team. But I guess we'll just take it to the chin, then. All right, next bus stop. I think we have to circle back and go one more time. So I think we, I think we have to go back down there and then back to base. So we'll see how it goes. Well, I really like this game for its, uh, like, the... Uh, the map that they picked is just awesome. Like, I like this type of challenging map. I wish there was a... Uh, it'd be awesome if you could choose other types of things to haul other than just passengers. It'd be cool if you could, like, drive a little truck with, like, uh, kerosene or something or whatever. Something dangerous. Pretty cool, though. It's got its sh fair share of problems, but for the third time that I'm playing it, I, I do like it. What's up, Kirky? How's it going? Hello. And again, if you guys want to see more of this game, make sure you aggressively show your support. Click or tap that like button. 
and do that on every single video. Show your support. Our channel is growing, and we got a lot of people who watch, and I want to see more viewer interaction or participation, so feel more than welcome to, uh, you know, say hi in the comment sections on video or say hi in chat. Might not get to everybody, but at least you uh, have the option to do that, so say hi. Feel welcome. there, Harry. Yeah, we'll talk business in private, Harry, anytime. It's better in private, because otherwise I'll forget. Alright, so going to uh, Moro Yable. It's pretty good. I like this part of the map. Kind of a nice coastal drive on this city. Others are claiming 30 to 50 frames per second on Epic. Uh, there's definitely some noticeable problems with the game, but it's not uh, it's not too bad. So again, Harry, we'll talk about business like that in, uh, in private, dude. Are we done here? Wait, oh, I didn't open the back door. Must have missed it. There you go. All stops have been approached. No passengers left been left behind. We left no passenger behind in this battle against the frames and the AI. Service rating 41, 12 crashes low. Where's the radar traps? They say radar traps. But I don't think there's any speeding tickets anywhere in the game. At least not that I've seen. Okay, not too bad for that being a very nightmarish road. The frames, though, that was our real challenge. Let's head back to base. How do we get there? How do I get back to, uh... Ah, oh, there we go. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do. And, uh, Archie, uh, we don't do that on this channel. We don't do it on other people's channel. And, uh, they don't do it here. So, uh, no need to do that, dude. Alright, let's see. Uh, we're gonna head back. I think we can just fast travel. Is the bus detailed? Pretty much. It's pretty detailed. I like it. Well, let's fast travel back there. Oh, there's a bunch of people watching this bus simulator game. I better get on there and tell them about an unrelated Discord link. G guys! Guys! Go to mm, and click mm, and then go mm. Okay, thanks guys. Thanks for checking out my channel. All right, let's get out of the bus. I wonder how what's her name's doing. We gotta actually get all of our uh, buses like repaired. We got problems. We got some problems. I like how the doors automatically open. By the way, I wish more games would do that. Like if I walk up to if I'm walking up to a door and I do this, doesn't mean that I want to put my face into it like it's the wall. I want to go through it, and that that's helpful instead of having to hit a hotkey every time. All games should do that. Do, do the doors automatically close? Oh man, this is Hitman. We're playing Hitman right now. All right, uh, we got some good vehicles. We got things scheduled. Let's take a look at our schedule for tomorrow or today. Oh, Hilda. She's already on that route, I think. Don't we have a third bus? Where's that? Oh, yeah, that not it already doing maintenance? Let's see. Oh, yeah, external workshop. Our maintenance guy sucks. I think I have to go buy parts on our own. Wow, we got $300,000 left in the bank? We bu Oh, yeah, that's right, because I took out 400000 and only spent one. What else do we have for contracts? Oh, now that I, now that I drove that route... Okay, I'm going to drive to the uh, maintenance shop and buy a bunch of parts, first of all. And then I'm going to come back and then see what we can do. God, please, car, do not be, do not be garbage. Please, car. Where's the uh, maintenance shop? There. Please, 
Please don't be bad, please. Please, please, please. Oh, did they fix this? Oh, it seems to have better acceleration. Oh, it seems to be a little more responsive. Nope, never mind. Nope, not at all. Alright, I'm gonna go buy some new parts for our... Oh yeah, and it comes to an immediate stop once you let off the gas. Man, what is up with this car? All right, let's go buy some parts for the bus. Dennis, thanks for seven. This car is so weird. You you can literally come to a stop by just letting go of the gas. Can't stop watching. Yeah, I know. It's hard to look away, isn't it? New subscriber shout out. God, those frames, dude. Oh, can I just? Uh, oh, I can look around now. Yes. All right. For whatever reason, I couldn't do that on the bus, but now it works again. Whoa, whoa, dude, whoa, 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 dude, 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 dude. Lori just trying to come into this lane and cut me off. Wow. I'm supposed to be the only bad driver on this map. That's not fair. You guy's taking my job. Alright, we're going to buy like a couple of everything and then get all of our buses up and running. And then uh, assign another driver to that route we just drove on. Did I travel to New York? While all of a sudden? Yeah, I know. Oh, the brake. The company, it's, it's really weird that you can tell your maintenance man to like... So you'll, you hire a mechanic and you tell him, Hey, tomorrow I need you to change the tires on the bus. But you have to go out and buy the tires first. Well, you're doing half the job of the mechanic by like having to go pick up the parts. Like... If I'm running a company for, you know, buses, it shouldn't be up to the boss to run out to, like, grab the parts. Like, it's like, hey, maintenance man, go grab some tires, bring them back, put them on the bus, th you know, get rid of the old ones, and we're good. Like, that's that's your job. Part 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 of my job is to, like, run the buy stuff and make business decisions, marketing and, you know, I guess driving a bus, too, since it's kind of a simulator. Otherwise, it wouldn't be as fun to the player, but what's not fun is doing these chores. Like, oh, my God. <sighs> this car is... So hard to drive sometimes. Everything's hard to drive in this game. Well, who am I kidding? Why is there a speed bump here randomly? Wait, can I buy parts here? Or is this only for bringing vehicles too? Well, there's a symbol on the other side. Wait, what is that for? Hold on a second. Uh, don't blame the car. Oh yeah, I have to, dude, because the controls are vastly different from the uh, from the bus. Not to mention the controls are programmed so that way, again, if you let off the accelerator, the car immediately initiates the brake. So to negotiate, I mean, imagine if in your in your own vehicle, instead of a brake, there was just the gas, and if you let off the gas, the vehicle then decides for itself how quickly it, it, it will it will be decelerating. You know how many more accidents there would be if you had to, like, everyone would be driving slow because if you had to come to a sudden stop or if you just wanted to slow down a little bit, you'd just come to an immediate stop. Is this for painting the bus? Okay, so I think this is where you paint the bus. And then over there, I think, is where you do maintenance. But then how do, how do we get parts? Because... If I go back to the computer and try to do maintenance, we, we have zero parts. How do I obtain parts for this? How do we get parts? Contracts, employees, vehicles, inventory. Yeah, like, look, there's spare parts here. Where, where do we buy spare parts? 
All right, so I guess we don't get them at the maintenance thing. It's like 14 restaurants in town. Wow, do you know how to drive? Uh, I don't think I have to answer that question because you just embarrassed yourself. <laughs> Got him. Yo, yo, Tober, you shirk. Big games. Okay, dude. Uh, where do you get parts, dude? There's like an electronics store up here. There's like some tourist sightseeing spots. Apparently there's a bi bicycle rental. What the? Why would I do that in this game? Why would I rent a bike? A kitchen store. So there is legitimately a, uh, a store we have to go to f to buy parts. But which one? Account oh, that's that's where we live. There's a furniture store. Where's the parts store then? Nudist Beach. Really? Kitchen store. Hardware store. Is a hardware store where you buy... I think that's for only modifying your apartment, which is a cool thing that you can do in the game, is modify the apartment. Kitchen store. I don't know where... Furniture store. There's, like, kitchen and furniture stores. But where's, like, a car parts store? This guy won't... We won't ever be able to do maintenance unless we unlock that. Repair shop. I thought we could buy stuff from here. It, it just doesn't seem possible to repair at the moment. Electronic store, bike rental. Is that over... Oh, that's by the airport. I think the airport's over... Oh, it's over there. Never mind. Huh. Well, I have no idea where we're going to get uh, back to the top of the map. Is there stuff at the top of the map? There's a car wash, sightseeing section. Lock stash, I think, is a different thing. Oh, what is this? Accommodation for sale. It's like GTA where you can buy properties and stuff. I don't know what to make of this. But anyway, our guy can't do maintenance unless we uh, have parts. So I, I don't know if he's going to buy them and just repair them. Top left of the map screen. Kitchen store. Lock stash. You mean like all the way up here? I'd have to drive all I don't I don't I'm not gonna drive all that way just to to check. The three bars. I'm just gonna drive back. I've no <laughs> I have no idea. Uh there's a small box, what on on the map screen three bars? Oh here? Toggle? Oh, I see. We can toggle. Um, bus pickup, industrial estate, petrol repair. Advertising company. Oh, that's what that is. Casino, bicycle rental. Bunker? It was like a World War II bunker here. Underground mines. Buggy parts. Oh, that's what that inventory is for. That's what that's for. So that'll count our inventory for the buggy. Okay. Well then will the will the maintenance guy repair stuff automatically? Then what's what's the point of food then? I don't know. The tutorial kinda like was like, alright, bye. <laughs> ah well, that's all good. Well, let's go back to the base and we'll get the other worker. Alright, well we know I guess I don't know, that's weird to me. Oh well. <sighs> This game, I tell you. All right, so what are we supposed to do now? I guess we'll turn off the car. Oh yeah, we can't get in this car until level four. I thought we shut this car off. There we go. Let's see if we can get in this car. Nope, still won't let us in. All right, well hopefully maintenance is automatic.
Apparently we only own two buses. Where'd our third one go? Yeah, wait a minute. Required one, available zero. That's why I thought that we had to buy our parts. So what, do I just have to randomly find motor oil? I don't know how that works. That's annoying. I may as well fire our mechanic and then just do nothing but external repairs. But then that also requires us to drive our bus over there. And that's just something I don't want to do. Like, this should just be automatic. So that way I can actually... Instead of spending the day driving over to the repair shop and driving back, I want to drive new routes. It just makes it easier to expand the business, since you have to drive the route before you are able to assign an employee to do it. All right, let's change drivers. Uh, now that I've driven that route, we can actually... We'll be making uh, almost $4,000 a day. Order parts online? Where, though? How do you do that? Oh yeah, this oh yeah, this will be available soon. That's going to be repaired. Hi there, Micah. How's it going? Let's get a new employee in here for a driver. Well, actually, don't we have one starting tomorrow? How do I uh there we go, employees. Oh, we got Lou. We'll see how that works. Let's hire another uh, driver. Wait, guide? No. Hmm, too bad there's no sorting filter. Please select an apartment? What? What do you mean, select an apartment? It's not my job to find these people homes and feed them and stuff. I'm not their father. I'm offering them a job. Hello, Eunice. I'd like to hire you. I'm sorry. I Error. I will need a home. What the f What kind of... What What do you mean? I need more apartments to what? How, how is these people? The hell? <laughs> what? Yeah, I'll need you to pay for my living expenses. He health, medical... Uh, I'll need all my food, and then if you could, if I could just go ahead and have money and not work, that'd be great. Like what the? What is it? What is this eight? What is this? Eight three eighty seven. Is that your rent? What I don't know. What what is this? I don't understand. Some applicants can only be hired if you offer them an apartment for relocation. Oh, that's what that means. Well, that, Oh, here we go. Perfect. Okay, relocate. Now that makes sense. That, now that makes sense. So that's not money to buy them an apartment. It's to relocate them. However, shouldn't I just give them, like, an ex extra money? You know, it's like, hey, you're going to get paid $1,000 a day, and we're going to give you an extra $1,000 for you moving here, so that way, you know, like, if you need to stay in a hotel for a little while before you find a place to live, there's your hotel money, and then, you know, you, it's also on you to find a place to live. Not mine. Jeez, hippie commune simulator. I wanna, I want, I want things, but I don't want to have to work to obtain them. Okay, millennial. Yeah, thanks. Um. All right, let's go to scheduling. Let's see. All right, so I'm gonna change this one to Callie now. She should be able to take that other bus. We're just winging it, I guess. Okay, so now t we got two contracts being taken care of by her. You love this Men of War Assault Squad 2 videos? Thanks, Ev. Appreciate it. Okay, so now let's take another order. We'll need. I think we need, like, another bus, too. Because I could just keep driving. I'll drive a route once, and then we'll add another employee. So let's try a new order. What do we got? 15, 2,000. Oh, yeah. Let's do these 2,000s. What does that mean? What does the watch mean? Oh, it means we have to do it in a certain amount of time, probably? Mm. Oh, we don't have any more available vehicles. That one needs to be repaired. All right, we got to wait a couple days till the repair is done. I also don't know how to cancel that repair. Vehicle collection. Collect man, lions, coach. Wait, is the driver? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So today I got to go pick up a new vehicle. 
I thought we already had that one here. And the other two should have their buses. Go to inventory for what? If you guys want me to do something, you have to explain why. Like, go to inventory what? Like, there's, n there's nothing here. I'm not, I can't remember how to order, if there is an option to order spare parts. Actually, I know there's not, because there's a menu where you can do it all from here. You don't have to look around the office. Like, there's inventory, but you can't buy anything. Alright, let's go pick up this new bus. Uh, this is where you live? Oh boy. When you uh, drive your car, does it come to an immediate stop if you let off the gas? Like, look at this thing. I will, uh... I will show you. Alright. We're gas, 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 gas. Alright, letting go, letting go, letting go. Hey, look at how it comes to a stop. It should keep rolling. So when you're driving on the highway and you need to, like, slow down, if you let off the gas a little bit... Can you go into neutral, please? Wait, now now the gear won't work? There we go. So yeah, when you're on the highway, if you let off the gas just for a little bit, because you're like, oh, I need to uh, slow down a little for this hill, it, it comes to a complete stop. Uh, hi, Raptor, go to contracts and get the parts in there. You get to go to contracts and get... What? That doesn't make any sense. Hold on a second. Well, it stopped because I hit the wall, yes, but you saw it slowing down ahead of time, right? That's what I mean. I'm, I'm not talking about me hitting the wall. I'm talking about me slowing down. Sir, oh, part services. What the? F Spare part services? These aren't contracts. This should be a part of inventory. Delivery cycles and days. Give me... Oh, I... Okay. That's really dumb and strange. Give me four of them every seven days. That's really weird. Why would I... What other service could do that? Wait, now that's all I can get? It's just... What are there... No contracts. Indicator. Four every week. Oh, engine. Uh, one every 30 days. That is strange. Thanks for the tip on that one, but I, I would have never found that myself. It may have been mentioned in the tutorial, but it just kind of avoids logic. <laughs> A router, one every 30 days. Air conditioner, one every 30 days. Yeah, that that's not how it works. Like, you don't... Um, you know, like, for example... If you were like, oh, I, I I need to buy some new oil for my truck, you you don't like enter a contract where you get like six quart of oil every fourteen days. Like this isn't, uh, it's not 1984, you know the book. All right, tires four every, eh, we, eh, we should probably get a few more tires than that. We'll get six. Brake lining. That way, if I speed up time, it won't be too bad. Uh, canisters of oil, let's do four every week. And uh, V-belt. We'll do two every 14. All right, Wi-Fi, don't need that. What is loss insurance, by the way? What is that for? Vehicle insurance, but what's loss insurance? If we don't make money, we get money? Ooh, I'd take that. Uh, you can spare parts from broken down buses found around the island. Ah, oh, thank you, Micah. Well, with that, then we could use them on our buggy. So that'll be cool. All right, there we go. Now we've got a little bit more of a hint on that one. Thank you. I like this game. Despite all of my complaining, I like this game. And I guess that's what means it's a good game, because it can have its quirks, and I still like it. Yeah, it is a strange way to get parts. All right, now, to test again, here's what we're going to do. I'm going full throttle. Okay, now I'm just l simply letting off the gas. That's, yeah. That's crazy. Ma imagine going full speed and stopping like that on the highway. It's like you're driving with flat tires. 
All right, we're heading down to pick up a new bus now. Actually, I wonder if we can quick travel somewhere. Let's see if we can do that. Where do we got to go, boy? Oh, yep, all the way back down there. Can I unlock that with quick skill? Oops. Wait, what happened? Where'd it go? How do I uh, unlock a new skill? Ah, here we go. Current level one. Oh, boy. Buy back all skill points. How do I uh, unlock a new... Yeah, I want to go down here. Can I do that? I want to unlock a fast travel point. All av uh, available skill points can be redeemed for fast travel points. You can also have the option to buy back all your skill points by selecting on the buyback. New subscriber shout out. Can I just do it this way then? Because I'm driving all the way down there again. Alright, let's see if we can go all the way down there. This game should allow you to get a few multiple uh, spawn points without having to do this. Where's the uh, oh, fast travel? New subscriber shout out. Oof. Well, we're, we're probably going to have to... Is this like this is kind of a, a cheat? Because if you can buy back your spawn points all the time, hmm. Do do do. All right, let's go pick up this bus. Whew. Oh, there you two. Wait, where's the uh, where's the bus stop? I thought it was up here. Oh, huh. Why did it make me point that way? It doesn't even show the bus on here anymore on the map. Why? Where's our bus? I click. Wait, if you click on it, does it just come to where you need it? Is this a custom bus? We can actually purchase and customize it. And that's what I plan to do if we can, but the game's being a little more difficult than I'd like. I will circle back around and try to hit the port. Now that, to be honest, right now I, I wish there was options where I could switch back and forth between managing the company and driving a bus. Like right now, I don't, I don't want to have to go pick up the bus. I don't want to have to, you know, drive it all the way back and do all that. I, right now, I just kind of want to drive some routes because I enjoy that. But bike rental again, sir. Why are you stopping so far ahead of the stop sign? Oh, now he's going. All right. What is going on? Oh, is that guy actually backing out? What are we doing? Well, I have to drive around this guy now because he's literally just stopped in the road. Come on. Oh, where do I got to go? Okay, so we got to go right. How's this game? Can I recommend the game? I mean... You know, you'll, you'll just have to go back and watch the three streams because that's the only way to really explain it. <coughs> it's a, a great idea, a fun concept, and I really like it. And it frustrates me to death, and I like it. Wait, this is out on the pier. I think we want to go over to the other side. Skirt, skirt! Yeah. Oh, there's our bus, but the symbol disappeared. Why did it do that? The AI is known to do that bug? Okay. Yeah, just stopping before a stop sign and then not move. 
That's a, that's a big bug. Oh. <laughs> Wait, what happens if we go in the water? What happens? Oh, it just resets you? Aw. Oh, I thought that was cool. Wait, where are we now? Wait, what? That was hilarious. Where do where do we where do we go? Where am I? <laughs> where did we go? Did we? Why is that boat flying in the water? Look at that boat over there. You see that boat? It, it's just like out of the water. It's just like hovering above the dock. Where's the bus? Oh, it's over there. I see it. Okay. Wow. Guys, I need a bunch of Epson chat. Thanks, guys. It's on a dry dock. It's kind of just hovering, isn't it? I guess air. if the air is dry. Okay, there we go. That was hilarious. I was really trying to see how, how well the car handled. Certainly better than the bus in tight spaces. Alright, let's go full speed and see if we can make it over there. Oh good, perfect. Actually, hold on a second. Hold on guys, I just need to get rid of the evidence here. Hold on. Ah. Darn. Yeah, car doesn't handle well in the water. Apparently you can't push other drivers out of the way either. Luckily you can do whatever you want in the car. I, I guess the nice thing about the car is that you can drive around and unlock all the other things that you didn't unlock with the, with the car and it's good for fetching the buses but that's about it but unfortunately you can't like bop anybody out of the way with it oh well let's go pick up our bus now all right attempt number two we gotta we gotta get that cool pull up oh Almost. What I was trying to do before is I was trying to just pull straight in behind the bus. I wonder if we can get on a boat. Can we go down there? Okay, there's our new bus. Perfect. Okay, let's see if we can go down here. Oh, don't tell me we can get on the boat. Oh, oh, what the? Ooh. Wait, why am I crouching? Okay. What? Okay. All right. Um, let's get down this bus. They're all white, though. Why don't we get some random, like, green bu uh, buses or something? Right, now let's see if we can fast travel back. This is what's weird to me. So, the game lets you use skill points in order to fast travel around the map, but you can buy back points, which it doesn't say that there's any cost associated with it, so essentially you can just cheat by teleporting back and forth from space to space. So now we can just travel back to the uh, to the office or whatever. I don't know. The game interests me immensely. Okay, now we got another bus. Have I been to the to the ghost town? I didn't know there was a, a ghost town. Okay. Now, what do we have for buses? Does it tell us that we have an extra one? We only have one. Oh, was that other contract just a one-time deal? Oh, that's probably what it was. Okay, let's take this then for infinite. Oh, I have to drive it because it's a... Oh, good. Hopefully that's the one we just bought. Okay, so now we have two routes going. 
And then the third one we have to wait on because the bus has to be repaired. Have we, is there not a way to ex uh, to finish the external workshop? Like I want to I want to cancel that. How do I How do I cancel repair? Uh what's up Dylan? How you doing? I don't know if there's a way to actually cancel a repair. Insurance, Wi-Fi, spare parts. New orders, completed orders, failed, current, nope. Yeah, I want to be able to cancel that maintenance order that we have. Oh well, let's see. Uh, inventory. Vehicles. I think we'll have to buy another second-hand vehicle so we can keep going. If we keep buying second-hand vehicles... Ooh, that's nice. Oh, 123,000? Okay, that's actually a nice bus, though. What? Condition. It still needs oil change and all that? Why would I pay that much, then? Let's buy a smaller one. Okay, we can get it from the harbor. Good. And we get that on the 26th. Okay. So we'll need to wait a little while. You can find it in the coastal area. Oh, that's cool. Now, how do we get food and stuff? I want to, I wanna, like, do all that stuff. Eh, all right. Well, again, if you guys are liking this, make sure you go ahead and click or tap that like button and subscribe if you're new around here. I know there's some people watching right now who haven't yet become a subscriber. So make sure you do that. Make sure you get your name popping up here on screen and showing your support for all of this wonderful content. Yeah. I guess mediocre at best content. This one's in workshop. Good, he's doing maintenance on it. Fantastic. So that one should be ready tomorrow. So that'll be our three buses. And then the fourth one on the way. And then we can hire a new worker. So it seems like it's a good idea to buy a bus, put it into the workshop to, uh, you know, max out its stats and stuff, and then send it out onto the road. Because when we buy these used buses, they're not giving it to us with, like, a nice tire change or anything. Oh, repaint your bus. Oh, there you go. Oh, looks like we can customize a bus. Do we have one we can buy right now? Oh, let's go Let's go drive into town and customize our bus a little bit. Let's see what we can do. These ladies aren't going to need that till tomorrow. Let's do a little bus customization. Alright, unlock. Alright, let's set a course for uh, the... Customiz... Wait, where... Wait, wait, wait. That's an advertising company. Is that where you spray paint your bus? Yeah, it must be, because... Oh, I wonder if we'll get money for, like, driving around with ads on the side of our bus. That might be a good thing. Okay. And thanks, as always, guys, for supporting every single video and all content, no matter what it is. It's nice to see you guys jumping into every single video and saying thank you very much for all the videos, that kind of thing. Instead of just repeatedly spamming for the uh, just the one type of video you want to watch, it's great to see everybody... Uh, watching all types of videos for all types of reasons, so welcome to all of them. Drunk Gamers, thanks for clicking and tapping that join button. Enjoy your new emotes, enjoy your new badge next to your name, enjoy having your name highlighted in green. Whoa, why? whoa, 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 whoa. This bus has some horrific brakes. Or am I just not used to it because of the car? Hold on a second. Oh no, the brakes are really bad. Oh. Is that a thing? Like, if, if the brake lines are bad, does it just slow down much, much slower? Ooh, the acceleration doesn't feel the same, too. Ooh. That might be an interesting factor. Maybe some of our buses will get better if we do a little maintenance on them. Maybe I can actually drive them a little bit better. Welcome. Nice. Uh oh. Uh, if you're wondering about the food thing, you can get it from restaurants. we got to go to a restaurant to buy, like, food to put in the refrigerator, though. So I wonder if uh, having a damaged bus, like, you know, for example, the V-belt or uh, brake lining or something like that, I wonder if that will... Uh, I didn't even touch that. That was perfect. That was a perfect turn. You can't, you can't, you can't do that to me. That was a perfect turn. I'm getting better. Oh yeah, they had a dino diner there? Yeah, that's where the dino diner is, dude. We gotta deal with Disney. Oops. It's really weird to me how we have to go with this roundabout just to circle back onto the highway. Maybe I'm just used to the car now. I don't know. All right, let's drive to the advertising company. Oh, this must be where there's a speed control. Okay. Do, 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 
do 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 Breaking is a little different. That's kind of cool. So the more wear a vehicle has, maybe that's why our car is so bad at accelerating and stops so quickly because there's like no. But that wouldn't make sense. We can't put our car into repair. There's no option to repair our car. So that wouldn't get better. But the buggy would be better for sure. Oh well. All I know is that I like this game and I'm going to be playing it more. Okay. Alright, now we can finally customize. Sweet. Uh, let's see. Oh, there we are. New subscriber shout out. Lil, thanks for subbing. Uh, the symbols on the side are blurry as... Oh, there we go. Oh, it takes like a minute for them to load in. Oh, we can't like customize? Wait. We can do our own customization. What color you guys think we should do? What do you guys think? Oh, there's off-road points. One is in Antigua, the other is in Jama Playa. Ooh. Are you a developer? Because you know way too much about this game. What do you guys think? A ye like a yellow? Ooh, this kind of like gold, goldish color. That's kind of nice. Is there a way we can save the color so we can use it on different buses? I don't like the fact that I can't, like, name it my own. Yeah, we have to pick our own color, because Raptor's mic blue. All right, let's see if we can match it up with my mic. Hold on. All right, let's see if we can do this. Is that close? <laughs> Oof, that's way too <laughs> that's way too much. <laughs> that's way too much. I think we want to go with like a nice gold yellow. That's not really gold enough. How was it before? Oh that's there we go. That like the canary canary yellow for Canary Islands. There we go. Let's go with that. Although, it really doesn't matter. Also, the fact that... So this is called the advertising company, but we don't make any money for driving around. Like, it, it costs us money to do that. So imagine that, where it's like, Oh, hi, uh, Greg from Sprint. Uh, you're going to go ahead and pay us $500, and we're going to put the Sprint logo on the side of your car. And it's like, no, you're not. You're going to pay me. That's the way it should work. All right, uh, let's go to... Uh, I guess let's just go back to home base now. We'll just teleport there. That's kind of cool. No real reason, though. Uh, that thing's ugly. I mean, you know, it's just yellow. I, it's unfortunate that there's not a lot of, uh, you know, customization options. Oh, you're a reviewer to test the game? Isn't the game out, though, for now? Like, isn't it released?
Hmm. Take it to the shop to see if they fix it. Well, our mechanic now can fix things as uh, we just need to get some parts delivered. Apparently one of our bus just needed to have... Well, that, that actually looks decent. That's not bad. Alright. So let's see what else we can do. Um, how do you get parts? So we went to contracts and we went to spare part services. And then we've entered a bunch of contracts where they deliver a certain number of parts. Weekly. Or something. Which is dumb to me because it's like... I would rather just buy like, you know, 10 tires, 20 light bulbs, and then just have our inventory that way. Whatever you use more of, you buy more of, and whatever you barely use, you just you have an inventory of it just in case you need it. All right, we have two current orders. Uh, let's go on a new order. We can take the small bus on this one, and this is an infinite route, so that's good. Let's take the small coach. Yeah, there we go. And then can we take a new order? So we should have three orders, right? Three scheduled routes. And then we have one bus that's in maintenance. So we'll have a fourth as soon as we can. And then I'll just I'll just take that other route. Okay. Isn't this the... Uh, don't I want the other bus for this route? Where's the other bus? Where does it store your buses? I need the other one. I mean, I, I can drive this bus, right? But I want to do the other one. You need to skip time? For what? Oh, for the scheduled trip. Oh, I see. Oh, but that means i got to bring this one in. Uh, you can do the shuttle service. Oh, that's true. Callie Miller had an accident. That's fine. Insurance is too expensive, so we're just, uh, you know, avoiding it because it's easier that way. Okay, so we've got three of these. So the new bus should be here. This is the same bus. Shouldn't it give me the bus that I need for the day? I assign myself to it. Okay, so let's see. Raptor is taking the... Wait, that is our big bus. Oh, where's the smaller one then? I don't like how it tells you the license plate instead of the bus type. Uh, I, can't, I don't think I... Um, sh shuttle services. Let's see if we can take those for contracts. No, I think those on on lock in time. Yeah, we got vehicle collection. I think that means. Oh, that's why. That's why I can't drive that other bus because we don't own the smaller one yet. I purchased it, but we didn't. I purchased the smaller uh, bus, but we don't yet have it here, which is weird because I think it made me select it. I don't know. All right, let's start the ignition. Thought we already did that. It stalled out and I didn't do anything. I didn't do nothing. All right, let's go. Yeah, so we one of our bigger buses in the, in the shop, the other two are in use. One's on the ship. I think I took somebody else's bus, but they're not going to be using it until later today, time-wise. So we should be fine. Can I tell you the loot, loot locations to get a million dollars? Sure. I mean, I don't think money's really an issue in this game because you can just take out loans, so it's not that big of a deal. All right. We're going in professional drive mode now, guys. We're gonna no more complaints, no more whining. We're just we're gonna do it right as we get to our next destination, and we're gonna drive people around. Shuttle bus is a good idea, though. That's what I thought we would start out doing, is uh, like picking people up from the airport and then dropping them off at the hotel and vice versa. All right, go 
going into Jean-Claude Van Damme mode right now. Super, super pro right now, guys. Raptor, don't make me mad. Why are you mad? What? What? That sentence doesn't make sense. Raptor, don't make me mad. Why are you mad? I'm, I'm not mad. Are you mad? Hi, Bartley. How's it going? How are things over in the UK? So my only real complaint with the game right now, the biggest complaint, is just the frames and optimization. Other than that, I think I can live with the weird contract thing with the, like, scheduling getting parts. And I really do like the fact that you can, like, buy insurance and Wi-Fi and have more accommodations for your passengers, which is really cool. Especially if, like, you know, like, you're competing with other companies and it's like, oh, this bus has Wi-Fi and air conditioning and etc., etc. Chill out, Raptor. Stop being mad. I know, guys. I need to. I need to cool it. You know what's great about this game, though? Within about an hour and a half, I really, I forget all about like ATS and all my previous driving games, and then I, I get used to this game again, and then it starts to kick butt, and I like it. But then it always throws something weird at me, like uh, you know, having to go pick up a bus again or something like that. I wish we could just. I wish we could just skip that. You know, I wish that process we could just skip. Uh, I'm happy I found a great new YouTuber who makes content I love. Yeah, guys, PewDiePie is doing great. It's wonderful. Enjoy. What's up, Barrel? How's it going? You couldn't ta possibly be talking about me, Kyle. I don't think so. No way. I don't get compliments. I usually complain. That's what I do. Some of my complaints, though, are usually legitimate, about, especially about this game. So I hope the developers... If they watch anything that I've said, or if if everybody's saying, "Oh, these things need to change," I hope they do because this game is pretty, it's pretty cool actually, and I, I would like to see this game in VR. However, it'd be a little more difficult to play because you also have to get out of the bus. VR is really good for games like flight simulators, especially like um, like combat simulators where you can like quickly look around, you know, because like there's there's other enemy planes around you, so you're quickly like looking around to find enemy planes. Um, but like ATS and stuff like that, I think those games are best played with you just like you know like this I think this is uh, the best way to play these types of games where you're just playing them on your computer you don't need you don't need VR but uh, track IR would be really good for this game so I would recommend this game with a steering wheel and track IR and then know that the game has a lot of problems and you're probably gonna get frustrated but keep on playing because it's actually I love these roads honestly I wish somebody made an ATS mod where you had to drive you know what would be really cool is a mod, like a mod for ATS or Euro Truck where you're an industrial driver. Like you're not really going into, you're not really going on highways or anything like that. Like spin tires except a little less mud. Bradley, thanks for subbing. So you're going longer distances than spin tires but still the same types of road conditions. Like there needs to be one called like a logging truck simulator. That would be cool. I would like to drive a logging truck. You're driving along some dangerous roads. There's differences in terrain. There's some dangerous bridge crossings. That's what gets exciting in uh, in spin tires, and I feel the same in this road too. Or this game with this road, like that bump we just went over. Raptor, what's the merch link? Sure, let me go ahead and drop that link for you. If you guys are interested, uh, we got hoodies, coffee mugs, stickers, and more available with the Dino Diner logo on it. Over a hundred people have grabbed that merch and has said that it's pretty cool. So, go ahead and uh, grab that merch today. Their Teespring store right there. If you guys are interested. If not, it's cool. Buy that merch. Buy that merch. There you go. I actually need to wear a Raptor hoodie. It, 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 would it be too much, though? Like, I'm Raptor. Wouldn't it, would it be too much for me to wear my own stuff around? That's, that's a little too much, I think. I like having it, but I don't know how I feel about wearing it. Trying to hit pedestrians? They don't uh, really come out on the roads. There's barely any people that walk around this town. It's too hot. Alright, we got one lady here. Ma'am, come on board. Alright. I wouldn't be surprised if she's just getting on right now. She's probably on. Can you hit cars? Yeah. 
I was goofing around with it earlier to see if I could like push other cars out of the way with uh, with my my other car, but it seems like the bus is the only one powerful enough to do that. Front is to get on and back is to get off. Yes, that is true. I just opened them both by instinct. Even though nobody needed to get off there. It's just a good habit. You'd hate to leave somebody behind. You'd get in trouble for it. And they'll be in the wrong town. Are uh, you going to join the Steam group? Excellent. If you guys would like to join the Steam group, check down below in the description and join that Steam group. Check out my Twitter. I'm going to be doing some uh, giveaways of free games of some pretty cool games, including one very uh, loved farming game that you guys were asking to see more of, too. So uh, go ahead and follow me on Twitter if you'd like to win free games, free keys. All you got to do is follow on Twitter. If you don't have one, make one. And I'll be giving those away closer to uh, the end of the year. So just stay tuned. There we go. Now I got more of a hang of this game. It's all about being patient, I guess. I'm not, I'm not patient. In a lot of games, I just rush in and I'm just too fast. I got to slow her on down. crazy. Well, thanks again, everybody, for clicking and tapping that like button, too, and showing your support. Greatly appreciate everyone's positivity and support as we're getting up to 400,000 subscribers. So for those of you watching right now who haven't yet subscribed, make sure you go ahead and click or tap that subscribe button. Your name will pop up here, and I'll give you a big old crazy shout out for all your big old crazy support for the entire month. Appreciate everyone being here. So thank you, everyone. You're all very kind. Some more frames going down there. Boy, it makes things a little tr tricky, especially in these tight turns. But so far, so good. We're at 395,000. Yep. We'll probably be there by the end of the month with everybody's support. This is uh, not Mexico. This is uh, an island, the Canary Islands. Oh, actually, there we go. Turn on the lights now. Hmm. Oof. That was a quick turn. Yeah, Micah, you should get farming sim and join us. It'd be awesome to have another person with us. Make sure you become a member, too, so you can join us for everything including our uh, logging stream. Maybe we'll do more of the logging tomorrow. We'll see. Watch for rock slides, they're telling us. Oh boy. This is going to get scurry. wall of China going up there? Is there a wall on the Canary Islands? That look like that looks like the Great Wall of China built under the side of that. Is there a wall on the Canary Islands for some reason? Oh, a kitchen, uh, like a store. Nice. Yeah, I can only go so fast in the bus. The uh, hills, <laughs> the bus only has so much power. Ooh, very good. We got more people here. All right, let's stop. Yeah, the roads in ATS and Euro Truck are boring compared to this. Oh wait, 
We've got to lock these after. There we go. All right, let's go ahead and save here for today. And we'll pick it up next time with more of Tourist Bus Simulator. Again, if you want to see more of uh, Rap Tours, make sure you go ahead and click or tap that like button and subscribe if you were new here. Today was a lot of fun, guys. So thank you very much for joining me. I'll be back tomorrow with, I think, some... Uh, we'll do some farming sim maybe tomorrow. We'll see. But as always, make sure you click or tap the subscribe button. Make sure you go ahead and click or tap the notification bell. And then you'll know whenever I go live with certain stuff. Plenty of videos out today. So make sure you go and watch them and like them. And I appreciate everybody with your support. You guys are wonderful. All right, I'll see you all next time. Thanks, as always, for being a part of my streams. And I will see you guys tomorrow for more. Take care. Have yourself a pleasant evening, everybody. Dino Man, out. Bye, everyone.